Hi, I'm Sue with Ogden Clinic, back with Dr. Picazzi, and the horse known as I'm Old Fashioned too. Yeah, so what we're about to do is to inject a scar to bury in his vocal cords and give him some competency where he won't be aspirating his head. So we'll go ahead through the procedure and we'll show you some details. <coughs> We start off by locally anesthetizing the horse's larynx. He's under sedation here, and I've injected local anesthetic. Dr. Schuler is showing the motion of the vocal cords with the normal uh, appearing vocal cord on the left side, but the deficient vocal cord on the right side after surgery, and we're trying to medialize that. The horse was very compliant with the procedure. Here we're doing a transtracheal injection for numbing, and you can see that I'm trying to get the injection of hyaluronic acid which we're trying to bulk up the weakened vocal cord on the left side. You can see the needle entering the scar tissue. The HA is an inert substance. The horse will have a bulking effect and hopefully the epiglottis can close to the scarred area and prevent the feed from going down to the airway. You can see some of the HA extruding, but otherwise the horse tolerated this extremely well. For more information on Dr. Picazzi, visit us at